peace infinite waters diving deep once again we are out here we're in nature breathing in that beautiful prana baby how to never feel alone on social media can i get a hello there we got a great question that came in on the instagram from a woman who wrote in saying let's read it word for word should we do that let's do that we've been doing it let's do it good morning infinite waters how you doing thank you for your videos i'm a big fan and friend i've been feeling the winter holiday blues this year very alone now that work has slowed down for me and it seems no matter what i do or who i reach out to raise my vibrational frequency i can't feel fulfilled many people i thought were my friends disappear on me when i try to connect or are too busy etc they check me up all on social media but it seems nobody cares to be there and spend quality time Hashtag #lonely Let me share with you what's helped me along my journey. Now, when we talk of being alone, being lonely, many of us are on these social media sites and we have a lot of virtual friends, but we've never seen them. And what's helped me along my journey is getting my ass off the computer and going to meet people oh my gosh i can touch you yes real people right yes people on social media are real but you got to see people face to face you got to feel them you got to touch them you can even taste them if you want can i get a hello there now i'm not one of these people who are anti social media no i love social media i love watching videos i love producing content but for instance i'm not a big fan of facebook you won't find me there a lot but i'll be on youtube and i have my own website and i'm on instagram a lot so it's all about asking which social media sites are working for you and which ones aren't when we talk of being alone what's helped me is realizing that we are never alone the universe always sends someone you see there's a difference between being alone and being isolated when you are isolated you are now disconnected from yourself but more so from those around you when you are alone you are now reintegrating all the parts of yourself back together you are basically tying your shoelaces again right so it's wonderful to embrace being alone i love it you can now meditate for goodness sake you can now get some peace and quiet until the cat down the road bothers you but you see many of us we're in resistance to being alone because we've never really had a chance to spend time with ourselves so you got to realize that maybe this is a sign for you to learn how to be with yourself to go into nature to woo breathe in that good ass prana baby and then see what is coming up oh my gosh where is everybody don't worry about it many of us we don't have a lot of intimacy on social media so you said you've got a lot of friends on social media but no one's there and what's helped me along my journey is meeting real physical people face to face making the effort to make that a top priority drive to them cycle to them skate to them walk to them just get to them and have a chat with them right because i've got 5000 friends on facebook but in real life probably got about 5 can i get a hello there 
I'm okay with that because I don't want tons of friends which are more like acquaintances and just dive in and then dive out of your life. No, the real friends I have are there for me. If I call them, they'll be there. But we have more intimacy, which means that there is more trust. There is more trust. There is more allegiance, right? On social media, people might connect with you, but do, do they really know you? right? On social media, people might connect with you, but do they really know you? Hmm. I make videos. I basically open up my mind to the world. And because of that, people feel they know me, right? So they add me and stuff, <laughs> but that's only one side of me. I'm a multidimensional being having a human experience. And so are you. So just realize that yes, on social media, people may edit their lives, but take social media for what social media actually is. And what is that? A great tool that will help you connect with kindred spirits because your whole vibe attracts your tribe. You see, a lot of us, social media should never be the place where you go to make friends. You can do that, but what about going into your local library, the local supermarket, going to the beach, going for a walk, right? Getting out of your house and meeting real, getting real interactions there and then. Because many of us, we can put a facade on social media, but your real friends, you know your real friends because they're always going to be there. They're going to support you. They're going to be your footstool. No, don't put your feet onto them, right? Don't do that. Not nice. A lot of us feel isolated because it's not that we don't have friends. We don't have friends that give a damn about what we're talking about, right? We don't have friends that actually care about our own sacred opinions and values. So what helped me along my journey was realizing that the secret of becoming your greatest version is to let go of whatever no longer serves you. And that sometimes includes friends right? What I call people you just hang around. If you've got a lot of people you just hang around, ask yourself, can you really connect with them? Otherwise, why are you with them? And you say, because I don't want to be alone, because I don't want to feel alone. But you see, what's even worse than being alone is being with a bunch of people and feeling alone. So I said, actually, I'm not going to just surround myself with people just to make them happy when I'm not happy and I can't express myself 100%. So I started to share content. I started to share videos. I started to put my message out there. And in turn, I reconnected with my reflections and it felt amazing. Can I get a hello there? So start being vulnerable by showing the world who you really are. And I guarantee you, you will find the right people who are going to support you. But also realize there is nothing negative with being alone. In fact, that's how you discover your true self. So once again, take social media for what it is, a great tool of connecting us all together, but also make the effort to get your butt out of the house and go to the local library or go to the beach or just walk on the pavement and you're going to bump into someone that's going to love you. You're going to love them. You're going to have some babies together. It goes something like that. Have a beautiful day. We're out here just having fun. Can I get a hello? <laughs> Infinite waters diving deep once again. Stay well. Stay healthy. Peace.